Yerp. What is good, y'all? Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy J.I. and I'm back at it again with another banger video for you guys, man. So, as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail of this video, man, today we are finally, finally, finally bringing this back to the channel man um a lot of you guys have been asking for this a lot of you guys have been waiting for this and a lot of you guys know like i really already did this once um but we ran through a whole bunch of issues with production so we had to go ahead and put a pause on everything um so let's go ahead and roll that intro and get straight into this banger man Alright you guys, so as you guys may or may not know if you've been in the loop with all the videos, man, I am currently out of town right now, um, and it's a little gloomy outside, so I'm not even finna go outside and try to make this video, so that's why I'm making a video from the hotel room, but anyway, um, let's get straight into the topic of today's video. As you guys can see, I do have on the OG JI Squad merch. Um, as you guys know, we have done a couple merch drops on this channel. We had the Outlaws merch drop, then we had the JI Mamba dr merch drop, then we had the JI Squad merch drop. And now we have the new and improved JI 1LE merch drop. So I'm going to go ahead and post a pick up on the screen so you guys can see what the t-shirts are going to be looking like. Um, I am going to be starting off with a very, 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 very limited supply of product. Um, I'm just, you know, throwing it out there, playing with the field a little bit and seeing how you guys are feeling about the merch. If you guys are liking the logo, if you guys are liking the design, um, I do have a new merchant that I am going to be working with who actually makes the orders and ships the orders all in-house so I really won't have to do anything like that I won't have to touch anything um, as far as the packages goes and everything should be basically shipped out as soon as you order hopefully that is the plan um, we are still gonna be doing pre-orders however what's gonna be different this time is like I told y'all I'm gonna have a limited supply on hand once we sell out of that limited supply and we get you guys' reactions and your reviews to the merch for the people who did buy the merch, then I'm going to go ahead and decide if either A, I'm going to up production on said merch or B, we're going to go back to the drawing board and come out with a different design. Now, that being said, there's a couple things that I wanted to touch on the merch before, um, you know what I'm saying, I actually bring it out to the public. Um, and one of the main things is going to be the fact that it says JI1LE. Um, so, as you guys may or may not know, bro, there's another content creator out there right now who just came to YouTube and has been on TikTok for a little while, I think. Um, his name is Ja, and he also has a 1LE. Bro also came out with merch. And his merch says Ja1LE on it. Now, as y'all know, I've had my 1LE for two years now, over two years. And I've had my custom plate JI1LE for that same amount of time. Now, that being said, that's where the JI1LE comes from. It ain't have nothing to do with Brody um, or nothing like that. I definitely wanted to make sure that I made that a point because I saw some comments on my TikTok live talking about oh bro stole the plate from Ja the glaze is hella real and oh god like I didn't even know who bro was when I came up with that license plate so there's that um secondly the brand name itself a lot of you guys were a little bit confused as far as the clothing brand goes um is it you know youtube merch is it merch in general is it just like a clothing brand and i just wanted to answer that for y'all too basically bro the byl is the company name okay it stands for build your legacy okay Basically, bro, at the end of the day, man, I personally feel that we all are put on this earth to leave our mark on this earth. At the end of the day, you want to be remembered for what you did in a positive light. What did you leave behind when you pass away and you go either up or down, whatever you believe in? You know what I'm saying? 
Um, so me personally, I feel like this clothing brand is my legacy. At the end of the day, I just want everybody to strive to be the best person that they can be because that's what I do. Every day I try to be better than I was yesterday. That's my goal. That's my mission. And you know what I'm saying that's my message. So that's why I have the company named BYL. It is Build Your Legacy. It is an abbreviation just because it's a little bit on the longer side of the name but i just wanted to make that clear um secondly like i said the merch will be dropping very very soon i think i'm gonna get at least 10 pieces for the very first drop so like i said it's gonna be very very limited bro it's not about to be oh i got like 50 shirts 50 hoodies whoop -de -whoop. no we're gonna do i think maybe five t-shirts and five hoodies whatever sells sells if the hoodies sell more than the t-shirts then i'm gonna up stock on the hoodies if the t-shirts sell more than the hoodies then i'm gonna up stock on the t-shirts it all depends on you guys and what you guys are liking colorways are definitely gonna be coming to the you know what i'm saying the clothing brand very very soon as well i definitely want to switch it up but i think just to start i'm gonna keep it simple and i'm gonna do white and black those two colors as of right now just simple clean that way you guys can kind of see what the merch is looking like we can see what it's feeling like on body like you know what i'm saying do they sit do they fit true to size or are they a little bit oversized but still true to size type deal and you know just make sure that the quality of the clothes are where i want them you know what i'm saying i don't want you buying a shirt for me wearing it one time putting it in the washer and the dryer and then going to go put it back on and the shirt then shrunk or the logo on the back starts cracking or you know stuff like that 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 honestly makes me upset um when i go buy something and i can only wear it like once or twice and now it doesn't fit me anymore it's mad frustrating so i could see how that would be frustrating for you guys and i don't want y'all to go through that so that being said um like I said, we're only going to do 10 pieces, five shirts, five hoodies, black and white with the, you know, obviously the design it has the red accents in there. So the red accents are definitely going to be in the design. I kind of have a feeling that the black is going to sell more than the red, the white will, but we'll see how that goes, man. Just a little insight on my new merchant. Basically, these are the people that make the clothes for 1320 racing. So if you've ever had a 1320 hoodie, if you ever had a 1320 tee, if you ever had any kind of merchandise from 1320 racing, this is exactly the type of clothing that you guys are about to get. So that's just, you know, a little bit of insight on the clothing brand. Yes, I am finally, finally bringing it back. I see your comments. I see your DMs. I'm bringing the clothing brand back I had to take a break just because the merchant that I was working with before was losing you guys orders was taking their sweet time to make the orders and it was just a big hassle especially since everything was pre-ordered bro you guys already paid your money and then I gotta sit here and say oh well I'm so sorry the merchant lost your order so here's your refund like a month later you know what I'm saying like I, don't, I didn't like that I feel like that was bad business and that was the whole reason why I stopped making clothes but now shout out to my boy rich he put me on with his merchant and his designer um so I feel like we have a solid team I actually just got off the phone with the merchant we have a plan I've already sent them over the logos and the designs and everything um, I'm waiting to get my email back from him um, he told me he was gonna work on it a little bit later today get some numbers and stuff like that going for me and then we can go ahead and move on with production so I will be keeping you guys in the loop with everything that goes on with the merch but yes the merch is coming back y'all BYL is coming back so I hope you guys enjoy what the t-shirt looks like please leave your comments in the comment section down below tell me if you like it tell me if you don't like it you guys' feedback means the world to me honestly i do all of this stuff for y'all i make this content for y'all i build these cars for y'all also for myself but i you know the videos are set to entertain and inform y'all so at the end of the day if you don't like it or it's not informing you or you feel like there's something that you could you would like to see differently or something that you want to see other than what like i'm showing or something like that bro 
or maybe I've showed something before and I just kind of like fell off doing that type of video or whatever, bro. Let me know in the comment section down below, bro, because I really, really, really want to keep like the the relationship between me and y'all very very transparent like you know what i'm saying i'm here to listen to y'all i definitely want to make content that you guys want to see but the only way i'm going to know like what you guys want is by you guys giving me constructive feedback i definitely 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 read all the comments as you guys know by seeing me reply to all the comments whether it be as soon as you comment within the hour within two hours or within two days i'm still replying to your comment so please 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 do your boy a favor drop a comment in the comment section down below tell me what you guys think about this design right here do you rock with it do you not rock with it let me know man and just stay tuned because maybe in about i'm predicting within the month we should have the first pieces out and ready to you know have photo shoots and stuff like that so you guys can see what they look like on person the clothing brand is for both men and females so you know what i'm saying like you need to get your girl a gift i got you you need to get your man's a gift I got you. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, just stay tuned, man. I've been really, really working on this behind the scenes for the longest, looking for the right merchant, looking for the right clothes, looking for the right feel, the shirt, everything. Like, I'm not playing no games, y'all. This is a very old hoodie. Like, I've, I've had this hoodie for a minute. And as you guys can see, we're still rocking. No holes, no rips, nothing. We're still rocking embroideries. We're switching from the embroideries to the overlays. So, Y'all just stay tuned with the kid, man. But without further ado, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I just wanted to let you guys know about that. I'm going to go ahead and roll that outro, man. And I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Peace.